Hello and welcome to today's episode of Being a Terrible Human Being. We normally like to play a little bit of Project Zomboid around here, but now we are starting to do a little bit of plaguing. If you're one of the Project Zomboid fans of my channel, do not click away just yet, because today we are doing something still relevant to the Project Zomboid series. So in this video, we are going to be playing the Nox Infection scenario. If you don't know, the Nox Infection is actually the Project Zomboid zombie infection. Now I tried to record a video on this yesterday and I realised I didn't actually activate the zombies and therefore spent hours waiting for something to actually happen. I'm not joking, it was painful. So this time around I've got a little bit more of an idea of what I'm doing and we're hopefully going to take out the entire planet with the Nox infection. Like the last video, we're going to be playing with the normal game difficulty. This means that 67.3% of people wash their hands, doctors work three days a week, and sick people get ignored. Now, this time around, we won't be making our own name. We will be going for the Nox virus name, as tempting as it is to recreate Zades 2. So the date is June the 25th, 1993. We are one day away from the American Independence Day. What could possibly go wrong? Letting me free with a zombie virus is probably uh, the start of things going wrong, let's be real. Okay, so we will be starting in Kentucky as well. We have officially started in the USA. Like all disaster movies, we are uh, starting in the apparent only country that gets affected by disasters. Okay, we have already been detected pretty much immediately. Okay, the Knox telecommunications have already been taken down, okay. So they're taking us very seriously, even though there's only two infected so far. Now, we have to unlock a lot of the transmissions, symptoms, and abilities. So I think we're just gonna evolve this first. So the Knox infection is created. It's guessed that it's from a biological weapon testing gone wrong and a foul smell is noticed. Okay, so we are now beginning. I think I want to spend my first two DNA points on spreading it via blood. Okay, we have successfully evolved the Nox virus. Hell yeah, we've got our first little bubble. Hell yeah, we spread it already. A whole five people, six people infected. Okay, we need to work on our ability to fend off medicine. So I think I'm immediately going to do drug resistance level one. And then afterwards, we'll look for treatment resistance one. We've already got enough points for that. So yeah, treatment resistance one. Let's put that in there. I think next I want to get cold resistance one. Because if you haven't seen my last video, Greenland managed to survive us. And I want to make sure we take them out early this time around. Okay, we're already up to hundreds infected. Okay, there are rumors of the exclusion zone sickness. Okay, uh, we're starting to spread. Not only are we spreading across the people, we're spreading across the news. We're getting hella famous. Okay, let's go straight for this cold resistance one next. And you know what? We're gonna make it transmit through the water as well. Look at that, we are now flying up. New aid program for poor countries. The UN has announced a new aid initiative for poor countries, making them less vulnerable to disease. Well, we'll see about that. We've already infected thousands now. I wonder where we're going to spread to first. Okay, we are up in Canada. Okay, by the way, let me know if you want a Project Canada uh, Zomboid video. I'd be quite interested in doing that. Okay, we already have another 24 points. What can we do with this? Uh, genetic instability. Okay, more work to for the cure. Okay, and we're going to do heat resistance as well. Okay, nice. We're more infectious than TB. Whoa, okay, America is getting a very heavy hit now. We're more infectious than HIV. That's a strange sentence to say out loud. Okay, they've all picked up on us. They know that we're spreading. Everyone in America may have it, but you know, we're still classed as a minor disease. The USA is now working on a cure, so we need to keep an eye on this in the bottom right corner. Okay, we're starting to fly all over the world now, and we've developed a coughing symptom. Oh my God, okay. Oh, God damn it. Right, let's work on our transmissions. People are going to hate this, but we're going to make it spread through dogs. We're going to say that's the reason why dogs aren't in Project Zomboid. Uh, we're going to go up to blood level 2. You know what? Water level 2 as well, making it even more infectious. Because next, we can get air, which we really want to use. You know what? I want to get this turned into an actual zombie virus as soon as possible. So what do I need to do to unlock that? Okay, the USA has shut down its airport. I think it's a little bit too late for that now. We've been added to a watch list, uh, just like you guys should be adding me to your watch list every time I upload a video. A neurological damage symptom mutated, okay. So we're now gonna spread it through the air. We're gonna add the insomnia trait. We're gonna add paranoia. What's this one here? So a fever, okay. One of the first symptoms is high core temperatures, fast dehydration and headaches can be fatal. And next, scratching, I think is what we're gonna go for. A second wave of the Nox virus is uh, heading out. Okay, I don't think the first one ended, but okay, sure. First death in France, people are dying now, and we're not even a zombie virus yet. 
We are really starting to sprint now. This is going to be lethal. Global research is now focused on the kill. Damn, they are up to 22%. Let's make this more deadly then. So let's add scratching and biting. Let's also add sweating as well, uh, as well as a nasty cold and hyper salvation. We're also going to up some of these drug resilience as well. Damn, Russia's now getting it heavy as well. We're more infectious than the common cold. And the cure's already 25% complete. That is really not good. Mexico is up to 35%. Okay, we really need to pop a stop to this. Finland begins to break down of all places to go first. I mean, Greenland is still untouched at the moment. That's very irritating. Right, what can we do? What can we do? So let's add anxiety. Uh, insanity will be next. And let's go for air level two. Ah, oh, the cure is already 50% complete. I don't want to lose this early on. Okay, it's dropped down to 37 we are managing to make a good dent in the cure we just need to keep on top of this though what's this genetic instability a new strain of the pathogen now exists increasing the work needed to develop a cure okay yes get that immediately 5.3 billion are infected and 59 million are dead and we're still not even a zombie virus yet okay we're still not getting the option to turn it into a zombie virus just yet ah oh, greenland have already closed off their ports and their airport that's not good I swear to God, if Greenland survive again. What do I need to unlock in order to get us the actual zombie thing that pops up? Okay, the cure is up to 62%. We might fail this. Cure 75% complete. What is going wrong here? Oh, I don't think we're going to do it this time around. We might have to try this challenge again. Oh, I think they're going to cure it this time around. You can't cure a zombie. Humans are getting close to developing a cure for Nox virus. Evolve the cryopathic reanimation symptom. Okay, how do I actually do that though it's i swear to god it's not giving me the option to do it i guess i have to unlock an insanity maybe okay the cure is 100 percent done now okay it's complete and we haven't even turned into a zombie virus yet okay we have already been eradicated we have completely failed with the nox virus i think we're going to give this another attempt Right, again, we are starting up in Kentucky. Right, I need to change up my game plan this time. I think I need to turn us into an actual zombie trait straight away. Maybe work on the symptoms more than anything. So we're going to first create the infection. We exist. Uh, we're then going to spread from air through blood as well. I think we're going to have to just transmit it a little bit for now. We'll leave all the, like, tackling of the cure until, you know, further down the line. I think the plan is, is just get a big chunk of people infected, and then once we've done that, just turn them into zombies and go crazy. Okay, we are going to have to do something about the medicine, so... We're going to give us drug resistance, uh, just so we can spread that a little bit more. And we're also going to spread through the water. Okay, we've already infected hundreds. I think I want to get to like a few million people, then we try and develop all of the symptoms into the zombie virus symptoms. We've already infected thousands. Let's start looking at symptoms. So we're going to start with the coughing one. We're going to add genetic instability. Okay, we've infected nearly a million people. In fact, we're going to get to a million very quickly. There we go. So we are now spreading incredibly fast. Fast. I think now maybe we hold back on infecting people and we actually look to make this more severe. Oh my god, America's getting it bad now. Please, Canada, just take a little boat journey to over here to just across to Greenland. Just, you know, a little little trip across. That would be lovely. Just, you know, one boat ride, please. Let's make it heat and cold resistant. Okay, we're starting to spread more now. We're going to more countries. Okay, keep spreading. Just keep spreading. Okay, the USA has shut down land borders. I think it might be slightly too late for that. Okay, okay, we're going up to Iceland, you know, even closer to Greenland. We'll get there eventually. Come on, just one little boat ride. It's all we need. It's all we're asking for. So let's add treatment resistance. And for now, let's start spreading it through dogs. And we'll go through both levels of that. And next level of blood as well. We're now going to start focusing on these symptoms to try and actually unlock the ability to turn this into a zombie virus. The first death in the USA. Okay, people are now dying very slowly though. Okay, the majority of our infected are still in America. So, okay, no, Europe's getting it bad now. Europe's starting to go crazy. Biting symptom mutated. Okay, nice. We didn't have to spend any points on that one. Again, Greenland have shut off their ports again though. I'm not happy about that. Okay, we have spread a good amount around the world now. So, oh, it's not giving me the next one to unlock just yet. What is this though? Insomnia will evolve that. So we've developed insomnia. We're now going to evolve paranoia. We're then going to evolve anxiety. And next is insanity. Oh my god. Okay, 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 okay. Central Europe begins to break down. Okay, sounds pretty accurate. Okay, what can we do? What can we do? Uh, let's develop the insanity one now. Okay, nice. Uh, we're going to make 
another genetic instability. Uh, in fact, make another one of those. Okay, we're really spreading. Now, please just let me develop this into a zombie virus. Oh, Greenland have locked off their borders. Oh, I swear to God, we're going to get them. Oh, we're just not unlocking the other symptoms. So let's uh, treatment resistance and drug resistance are going to evolve as well. Okay, the world cure is only sat on 12% at the moment. We can handle that. Okay, 5 billion people are now infected. Okay, have we unlocked anything new just yet? No, we're still struggling a bit here. Let's add another drug immunity. Why not? I feel like people are going to be screaming in the comments that I'm missing something here. Okay, we've managed to spread to Indonesia. Okay, they're baffled by our mutation patterns. That's probably because even I don't know how I'm controlling this. I'm just going with the flow. How are we looking on here? So there's still 328 million healthy people in the world. They're all in Greenland, Morocco, Madagascar, the Philippines, New Guinea, and New Zealand. Okay. Cure is already 25% done. When is it going to unlock the ability to let us actually turn into zombies? Like, I'm just not seeing the option anywhere at the moment. Maybe work on transmissions? Okay, I'm just going to speed up time and see if anything develops. Okay, we have enough points to go for water level 2 now. So hopefully we can start spreading it through the air, then maybe... Oh, here we go. Now that we've done that, we can start adding the fever. Brilliant. They're up to 30%. We really need to get a move on now. Fever symptom mutated. Okay, cool. We didn't have to spend any points for that. Okay, next, let's put the sweating up now. Hyper salvation. Okay, we still haven't unlocked the actual zombie one just yet. We're only sat on 40 million kills so far. God, that sounds like a That Guy Peds Project Zomboid video with how high the kills can get. We've killed more than the Spanish flu. Okay, nice. Nobody clip those comments and uh, take them out of context. Hyper salvation symptom mutated. Okay, cool. It's doing it for us. Okay, what's this? So we've now unlocked this, the super aqua transmission. The virus is highly contagious and will adapt to humans. Uh, we don't quite have enough for that just yet. Uh, is there anything else we can evolve? I mean, there is the nasty cold one. Uh, why not? We'll go for that. Hopefully we develop this automatically. Okay, the deaths are starting to shoot up a little bit more. We've automatically developed this super aqua transmission symptom. Okay, nice. Now can I get some zombies? Yes, this is what we need. Rihanna we need, oh fuck, we need 16 points. Damn it, how are we going to get 16 points? That's going to take ages. Okay, right, we are currently on four, so we need to save up 12 points somehow. Killed more than smallpox. Okay, cool. <laughs> Please, I just need more points. Keep these orange bubbles coming. I'm going to need a lot more of them. Deaths are flying up. I'm hoping all of these turn into zombies. I think it'd be kind of cool if we make it to, like, 2003, because then, like, all the, uh... 10 years later, Project Zomboid videos will be lore in this world. Please, I swear to God, we're only halfway there to the 16 that we need. Billion people are dead, though. We're not even a zombie virus yet. God, the deaths are really shooting up. Is it a fail if we end up killing everyone before they turn into zombies? I feel like it might be. Okay, 12 points. Okay, we are so close to turning them into zombies. Just four more points. The cure is still on 40%. I don't think they're going to cure it. Yes, okay, yes. Yes, pause. Right, we have enough points. Here we go. We are now going to turn them into zombies. Okay, I don't know if we're going to unlock this next stage of it, but we are now officially... We have zombies, everyone. We have zombies. We've actually turned into a zombie virus. The dead are being reanimated. Okay, cool. So we've now only got 25 zombies. 98,000, 300,000. Okay, we're going to go ham and we're going to go take on Greenland together. Hell yeah, millions of zombies already. Right, I'm pretty sure this now unlocks new things for us. Or at least I thought it did. Okay, we already have 200 million zombies. We're going crazy now. Oh my god, half a billion zombies. The USA is in anarchy. Okay, I'm not surprised. Oh, damn. We're up to over a billion zombies. Nox virus turning people into zombies. I mean, yeah, keep up, dude. There's already two and a half billion of them. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Oh, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god, oh, my god. oh, oh. Okay, Korea's now gone, so if you're Korean, uh, my apologies. Oh, okay, no, just, just pause, okay, this, this is, okay. Um, ooh. Okay, we're now up to 87 points, so what can we do with this? Aerobic resurrection, we're going to evolve that, we're going to make enhanced sensory integration, hell yes. Uh, Cathamernal shift, what the hell is this? Uh, we'll leave that for now. Mummification though, we'll do this. This is just going to be OP now. Oh my god, oh, oh. Uh, 
Zedcom has been activated in Greenland. You know, fuck you, Greenland, as usual, ruining all of the fun. We have 127 points, so let's transmit it through the air some more and see if this helps us spread to Greenland somehow. Okay, oh, what's this? Aerosol stability one. The virus splits, creating aerosols that infect one random country. Please be Greenland. Uh, this is going to send it to another three random countries, and this will send it to another five. Okay, now we're just going into the atmosphere. That's just OP. Come on, Greenland. Greenland should now get it. Why is it not working? Why is it not working? Greenland should have it. Don't tell me Greenland are going to get away with it. There's still this many countries that are fine. Like, we should have just split and infected all of them. Zedcom to set up a new base. Oh, fuck off, Greenland. You should be infected right now. Okay, they're setting up in Madagascar. Okay, just keep rubbing it in my face, even though both of you should now be infected. No! Okay, the zombies are massively dropping. We're below 10 million now. Uh, we seem to have failed. I mean, we kind of got cheesed a little bit because it should have split and it should have gone to the countries that we didn't infect. However, it's looking like they're going to get away with it. How are we looking overall? Yeah, only Iceland and Peru are still infected. I don't know how it didn't spread to these other countries. That's such bullshit. Zedcom grows stronger. Yeah, shut the fuck up. Okay, and there goes all of our zombies. So there are officially no more zombies. And they're claiming it as a win. They're claiming that they've eradicated us. Cool. I'm incredibly disappointed with that. We should have wiped out the whole world, but for some reason, some of the symptoms didn't work and it just didn't split and spread to the countries that weren't infected like it should have done. Oh well. So we managed to infect the whole world within 1,678 days. That is not too bad whatsoever. Oh, okay, we did fairly well. I'm just very disappointed that once again, Greenland got away with it. So if you have enjoyed this video, you know, do give me a like, do subscribe if you want to see more Project Zomboid or Plague Inc. videos. And do let me know if you want to see another one of these videos where I take on Greenland specifically. I don't care about the rest of the world. I just need to target Greenland. Uh, apart from that, thank you so much for watching. I hope you all have a great day and goodbye.